We're going to randomize both lists here seven times a piece and then stack the lists up side by side. For the record, Andrew, that's your one with the star. It's kind of small to see. Maybe I should put a different symbol so it's bigger. How about a big hashtag? <clears throat> so we'll, we'll stick with the hashtag. That way it's bigger. So you don't have to squint to see it. So anyway, we're going to put the ra the owner list through the random seven times. And then we're going to put the uh, uh, wait list through here seven times. And uh, stack the list up side by side in this sheet right here. After they go through the random. Yeah. And, um, well, <laughs> so that will be randomized seven times. Let's do it. You're welcome. And good luck to the both of you. So we're going to random this list up seven times, everyone. All right, lucky number seven. And now we're going to do the same thing with the very next list. And that's how you'll get your weight class. So let's send the weight class list through. Seven times. Bing, bang, boom. Lucky number... Seven. Now you can see your weight class in the break. Hope. And I'm going to organize this into alphabetical order by weight class. So you'll see... Uh, Andrew with the welterweight down on the bottom of the list. Right there. So that's what's going on. Let's get ready for the rip. And anyone can make a trade. If you want to put a trade offer out there, if you want to put your weight class on the block, now is the time to do it. So we're looking for some of the big hits to come out in Prism UFC. Let's see what we can find in the break. Good luck. UFC. UFC. Okay, so I noticed we're a little choppy. I can see that we're a little choppy right now. Is any has anyone just seen a little choppiness? I'd love to get feedback during this video because we are in the middle of tweaking some of our um, settings and stuff, and we're working on uh, improving our video quality. Uh, most recently, especially ever since this one storm hit, we've been getting more lag than we used to, and so we're apps we're getting ready to move offices probably because the they've been unable to fix it they keep trying to fix it okay so lag on the audio so uh your feedback is going to be very important here for us as we are in the middle of fixing a a problem that's been going on and they've been unable to fix it for us so we're trying to either move or we're trying to do something to really fix it they're saying Okay, so thank you very much for feedback in this video. Appreciate that. It's going to make a world of difference for us. Because we, we're not going to have lag for much longer. I can tell you that if it's been going on, we want it gone. We do not want lag around here. Uh, but we want big hits. Right, broski? Ho! 
We want the big hit. So we're going to find him. Come on, that's a flyweight right there. That is a flyweight fearless for Brian. Here is a, that's a boom, 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 boom. And I'm going to, I'm going to try to go through here slowly because I know we are lagging a little bit. There's a flyweight. And uh, you should, uh, we should, we will have video out if you miss anything from the break because of lag. We will have a video out for you to be able to click on and watch it, you know, because everything's being recorded. Uh, so, <laughs> all right. Yeah, it's looking pretty smooth so far over here. Uh, it started off choppy, though. It started off choppy. Here is, um, this is the green pulsar. And this is the Bantamweight Green Pulsar. So that is our first prism. This one's not a numbered prism, but it's a nice green pulsar. So some good things coming out. We're looking for the big rookies. There's a rookie right there. That is a heavyweight rookie. Instant impact. Very nice. More rookies. Oh, that's a big rookie to get right there. Welterweight owner. Congratulations, Andrew H. This is yours, Andrew. And I know Brian is, uh, I think you got someone with you named Brian. Let me, let me make sure that's correct. But this one is Andrew's. Ryan. Okay, Ryan W. and Andrew are having some fun. And this one is for Andrew. That's a big rookie, my man. All right. Silver. Silver Prism. Hope. Who's got the Silver Prism? Got a lot of reflections. It's light heavyweight for Brian Broski. Way to go, Broski. Boom. Nice silver. He's a big name. Uh, a lot of people really are big fans of Cody uh, Garbrand. He's he's a big popular guy, and uh, so that's cool to see his come out. I actually was following his fight the other day. That's that's a uh, bantamweight, right? Yeah, yeah, bantamweight. He's got a, a big following of fans for him. <laughs> okay, Brian. You're right. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> what is this? It's another pulsar. This one's uh very unique right here. So wow, look at this. Oh my. Who oh. knockout artist. Boom. Look at that, 7 of 25. Oh, my, what a hit. What a hit. So I'm assuming this is Bantamweight, broski. This is a huge hit, man. 
This is a huge hit. This is not a green pulsar. This is way better than a green pulsar. This is number 25. This is a monster hit, bro. So, Broski hits, I'm, I'm assuming, I don't know a lot about UFC, I know a little bit, but this is a Bantamweight, I'm a, a, because it says on the back of the car she's defending her Bantamweight title, so that's how I come up with this being a Bantamweight. I'm pretty sure I'm correct on that. I don't see why it would say that if, it, if she was not a Bantamweight on the back of the card down there at the bottom. So you can see she's defending her Bantamweight title. So that's how I'm assuming that this is a Bantamweight card. And that's a monster hit. I'm going to put it separate and treat it like a multi-thousand dollar card because I believe it could be up in that category. <clears throat> okay, so um, more good things. We've got some rookies. There are so many $1,000 hits in UFC Prism. It's a debut edition. So many $1,000 hits. Robert Whitaker. Fireworks. And we finish the break with the Williams rookie. So, yeah, I can't wait to try and look this hit up right now. It's a couple hundred. Okay, Seth is into Seth knows a lot about this product and, and stuff. He's been following this product really closely. Okay, so Seth is probably right on saying that that's a couple hundred dollar hit. And it is a Bantamweight, right? I mean, it's got to be a Bantamweight, so... Anyway, good things happening. Lots of fun in a UFC rip around here. We got more of that available. I'd love to rip another one with everybody. And you can get into the next one right here. And we've got all kinds of other breaks coming up too. So we're going to hit something big in our next break as well. <laughs> 